It is synthesized by paraventricular nucleus of hypothalamus and it acts on my myoepithelial cells of mammary gland and the uterus. Actions of oxytocin on mammary glands. It causes ejection of milk from mammary gland. Oxytocin causes contraction of myoepithelial cells. It squeezes milk from the alveoli to the exterior through the duct system on nipple. The process by which milk is ejected from the alveoli of lactating breast is called as milk ejection reflex. So this is the milk ejection reflex that is suckling of the breast causes stimulation of the stretch receptor which is uh, through the vagus it is going to cause the stimulation of paraventricular nucleus and it causes secretion of oxytocin which is released in, in the posterior hypothalamus and thus released oxytocin in the blood reaches the myoepithelial cells of the breast tissue and causes contraction of myoepithelial cells and uh, it leads to ejection of the milk in, in the mouth of the baby which is called as milk ejection reflex or milk letdown reflex. On the uterus, on the pregnant uterus it causes contraction of the smooth muscles of uterus and helps in the expulsion of the fetus. Sensitivity of the uterine musculature to oxytocin is enhanced by estrogen and inhibited by progesterone. In late pregnancy, the uterus becomes very sensitive to oxytocin due to the increase in the oxytocin receptors and oxytocin secretion is increased during labor. At the onset of labor, cervix dilates and fetus descends through the birth canal and expansion of the birth canal stimulate the stretch receptors. From them, impulses goes to the pituitary through the afferent fibers which in turn increases oxytocin in the blood. This will reach the uterus through general circulation and this enhances further strong contraction of the uterus and favors delivery of the baby. On non-pregnant uterus, oxytocin acts on the uh, uterus to facilitate the sperm transport. Oxytocin released causes uterine contraction and facilitate sperm transport. Other actions in males, at the time of ejaculation, it causes increased contraction of the smooth muscles of the vas deferens and helps in propelling the sperm towards the urethra. So this is the diagram showing the parturition reflex, uh, increased estrogen and progesterone ratio and causes increased contractility of the uterine muscles. The growth of the fetus and descent of the fetus causes increased stretch of the uterus increased that increases the uterine contraction increased pressure on the fetal head on cervix then nerve system communicates with the uh, posterior hypothalamus uh, and there will be increased uh, oxytocin release that uh, increase uh, the in uterine contraction and that becomes a vicious cycle and it leads to parturition reflex.